Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel Tarot Dreamer. Um, this is the new weekly readings I'm doing and these are for the collective star signs. So these ones are for our lovely fire signs, Aries, Leo and Sagittarius. Okay guys, I'm sorry I'm a bit late with these readings. Um, I usually upload them over the weekend for Sunday. Uh, it's now Tuesday but I have a frozen shoulder at the moment. So um, I'm in a bit of pain with my um, shoulder and neck, um, but uh, I just wanted to explain, that's why these are a bit late, so I'm sorry about that. Um, hopefully my uh, frozen shoulder will get better within the next week or so. So it's raining in the UK at the moment, it's a bit overcast, so I've put on the light and uh, you may hear the rain outside. So, as usual, let's get on with your reading. We have three columns, one, two, and three. Um, if you want to concentrate on the column that you're drawn to, and um, I'll give you a moment to focus on those, and then we'll get into your reading. Okay, guys. Okay, so let's start with column one. And we've got a fortune card, uh, a tarot card, and an angel message for this week. So let's start with your fortune card for those that chose column one. And as I said, this is for our lovely fire signs, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. So the fortune card for this week is Journey. So somebody could be coming to see you. Or you could be taking a break and going to see somebody or taking a short journey somewhere. Maybe linked to your work. Let's find out a little bit more. Make sure this is in focus for you guys. The lighting's not that great. And we've got the Four of Cups, the Four of Water. And this is Missing an Opportunity. Okay. And it says, open your eyes to the possibilities. So the four of cups uh, in the standard rider weight is the guy sitting under the tree usually. And he has three cups in front of him that are spilled over or that are there in front of him. And the universe is offering an opportunity in the form of a fourth cup, which he doesn't seem to see. Or he's um, he's become dissatisfied with life so what this card is asking you to do especially with the journey card is that there is an opportunity don't miss an opportunity this week that you may not see that's coming in for you and it could be coming in in a form that you don't recognize here okay so the final card is your angel message for this week guys and it's look for a sign and again that goes with this message here which is don't miss out on an opportunity that could be disguised as something else and you just pass it by because it could lead into a whole new different thing for you here. There's an opportunity coming in. Look for a sign. Don't miss out. Exciting. OK, let's move on to column two. And column two for our fire signs. The fortune card for top, for those that chose column two is change. So there's a change that's coming in this week. Uh, those of you that are moving home, uh, going to live somewhere else, or even a change of a vehicle. But there is a change coming in this week. And that ties in with your tarot card, which is the five of swords, the five of air. Now, usually the Five of Swords is conflict, um, and it's saying an unwise choice. Learn what you can do from this situation and review everyone's motives. So there is some kind of change that could be coming in this week that not everybody is going to agree with, and it could cause some kind of conflict here. So let's see what our angel message is for this column and it's an opportunity so what it's asking you here is there is an opportunity coming in not everybody is going to be happy about this opportunity because it's going to bring out bring some kind of change with it so not everybody is going to be happy for you 
or with regards to this particular change but there is an opportunity coming in this week for those that chose this column okay and let's move on to column three if you could like comment subscribe guys we're nearly at 300 subscribers and once we get to 777 subscribers i'll start doing my monthly in-depth love readings and they're to do with love and relationships and they'll be tarot based guys so if you're interested in those please do subscribe it does cost nothing to subscribe it is free and um yep once we get to 777 subscribers there'll be lots of in-depth love readings um, with the tarot cards okay so let's return to this and column for those that chose column three your fortune card is distant horizons now i love this card because this is a card of maybe dreams coming true um, and something new coming in that expands your world here now let's see how it ties in with your tarot card for this week and that's the eight of cups the eight of water a desire to move on the search for something more meaningful spiritual and emotional growth and again this could be seeing you moving away from something that's held you back and expanding your horizon expanding your spiritual knowledge going on a spiritual quest a spiritual path you know um the eight of water is somebody who usually turns their back on what looks like a successful situation in order to grow um and in order to find their path in life but they do usually return it's just that they they need to walk away from something in order to find a deeper meaning within themselves and let's see what your angel message is for this week and it's forgiveness so here forgiveness tied into the eight of cups is usually you're walking away from someone who may have done you wrong here or you're turning your back on the situation in order to expand your own world and find something more within here but it's asking you to forgive or find some kind of forgiveness because after all we don't have to forgive and forget but if we forgive it's it's in a way it's forgiving ourselves uh, so we can in fact walk away and move on and move on with our lives to create our own dreams okay i hope you've enjoyed your weekly reading and like i said this is for our fire signs aries leo and sagittarius and uh, thank you for everybody who has subscribed to my channel it really does mean a lot it's helping the channel to grow um, and as always always believe in yourself guys follow your dreams and stay blessed